long ago, when light and darkness still bore life. The goddess emerged from the light, and an entity known as the Vile God burst forth from the darkness. battle ensued between the deities. The light tore the darkness to shreds. Darkness corroded the light. And eventually, both sides lost their spark of life. And so, the goddess and the vile god fell into a deep, eternal slumber, like a dying star emitting a final burst of light before imploding into darkness. this place. I'm thinking about spending the rest of my life here. Huh? Don't you know where you are? You're in prison. Brooklyn? The Slammer? The Crowbar Hotel? I know exactly where I am. Heaven! Seriously, this place rocks! I get free food and as much sleep as I want. In fact, I want to retire here. Stealing food in this town is a serious crime! You'll be punished with a hundred sharp slaps on your wrist! Your hands will get so swollen that you won't be able to move them anymore! That's fine. Just means I'll have an excuse not to wash my face. I'm awestruck by your stupidity! How are you supposed to eat if you can't move your hands? Good point. Let's get out of here. I'm tired. You're gonna have to carry me the rest of the way. Huh? What are you talking about? You haven't even walked ten steps yet! Prison life has made me soft and weak. Now stop complaining and just carry me already. Quit messing around! You've only been locked up for three days! Stop talking back to me all the time, you stuck-up fairy. I'm the master here. You should be thankful that I'm even trusting a fairy with my amazing body. Just so we're clear, I'm not your slave. Got it? Fencers and fairies are equals. Remember that. Now be quiet. I put the guards to sleep with my magic. Let's hurry up and get out of here before they wake up. <laughs> I guess I've got no choice. <sighs> Why did I get stuck with someone like him as my partner? Man, I'm starving. I wish someone would donate me some bread. How's it going? You're not from around these parts, are you? <laughs> Is that obvious, huh? Hey, what's the deal with that sword? Oh, that? That's a fury, one of those old fairy weapons. That sword's been stuck there since before this town was built. Occasionally some foolhardy guy will swagger up to that sword to try to pull it out, but so far no one's managed to do it. Gotcha. Does something cool happen if you pull it out? Who knows? Every kid knows the legend, though. If you wield a fury, any wish you desire will be granted. Tell you what, if you're feeling confident, why don't you try pulling out that sword? I see. 
If it grants any wish, then I could wish for as much food as I want. Give me some food. I am the life that resides in the fury you hold in your hand. Oh, what's your name? I'm Fang. Give me some food. Nice to meet you, Fang. That sword belongs to you now, and with it, my power is yours as well. From this day forward, you are now a fencer. You're going to help me collect the furies. Hey, wait a minute. I shut my mouth and let you give your little spiel, but this is where I draw the line. A fencer? No one decides my fate except me. Now, hurry up and make with the food. Fencers are sword specialists who fight to collect the furies. That sword in your hand is just one fury out of a hundred. If you gather all the furies and revive the goddess who has been sealed away with the vile god, your wish will be granted. What the hell? That's not what I was told. You're a fraud. A big fat fairy fraud. I thought I just had to yank out this damn sword. Not at all. That's just the beginning. Now come, young fencer. Let's begin our wondrous adventure together. No. Huh? What was that? I said no. I don't want to be a fencer. That sounds like a pain in the ass. Just thinking about collecting 100 weapons makes me sleepy. Hey! You're the one who broke the seal and woke me up! That makes you a fencer! You've already formed an unbreakable bond with me, so don't say such hurtful things! An unbreakable bond? I'll break any bonds I want. Later. Wait a second! The one who pulls out the sword is destined to revive the goddess with me! Good cool story, but I don't take orders from anyone. I'm the one who decides my fate. Bread just because you pulled out that sword? Just how naive are you? I didn't steal it. I just thought it was a free sample. I should have just pawned the sword for some cash instead. You're terrible! The Fury chose you! Don't you know what that means? And the Fury has a super cute fairy living inside, instead of some old man or weird creature. You should be thrilled right now. Come on! Hey, you there! What are you doing? Oh no! I found you! Yeah, thanks to you screaming at the top of your lung. All right, fairy. There's only one option. As your master, I order you to sacrifice yourself. How many times do I have to tell you? I'm your partner. We're in this together. Now come on, fight! Use me, Fang. Use the power of the fury. Fairy Link! Uh, I don't know what the hell is going on, but I guess I've got no choice. <laughs> Me. I'm not a regular sword, you know. 
you can do powerful attack combos and dominate your opponents. That's it. Seriously, that's nothing special. <laughs> I'm a fairy, remember? That means you can use me to cast magic. What? Magic? You should have said so before. Monkfish foie gras roasted meat? That's the stuff I want to eat! Come on, food! Hey, I think your magic's busted. Then what are you doing? It's not that kind of magic. It's attack magic, got it? You... Ah, uh, it's not useful at all. What are you talking about? Times like this are when it's most useful. Now let's go! Let's do this! Stop resisting! Possible! Get ready! Get ready! Up next! Impossible! That was nothing! I didn't realize I was so strong. Well, I guess it's not that surprising. I am pretty awesome. That's right! You've had potential as a fencer all along! Now let's get out of here! Before you attract any more guards! I'm sorry, remind me again who attracted their attention in the first place.
Get ready! It's not over yet! Stay down! Impossible! That was nothing! New power! Resisting. Not yet. Stop resisting. Stop resisting. Keep going. Not yet. Impossible. Get ready. Stay Stop down. resisting. Impossible. Get ready. Executing shooting slash. Here I come. Let's go, Aaron. Stay down. Impossible. Here. 
Get ready! Stay down! Impossible! That was nothing! It's not over yet. Not yet. Get ready. Next. Impossible. Let's do this. Stay down. Impossible. That was nothing.
Fencer. Huh? Nope, not me. I just accidentally became her first, and now she's trying to hold me responsible. I'm basically a victim of fraud. Now's no time for joking around. I get the feeling this guy's the real deal. I came here to confirm reports of a Fury sighting, but I never expected it to come directly to me. I suppose fate demands that those who walk the path of the sword to meet in such a way. Hey, hold on! Did you hear anything I just said? Regardless, my search for the Fury is ended. Let us now trade life for death, and see who stands the stronger warrior. I'm telling you, I have no interest in all this Fencer stuff! To battle! Out of my way! Let us begin. <laughs> know your place. with this guy? Is this the power of a fencer? There is nothing behind your blade. No resolve. No- You are a fool to stand against me with such a blade. Blake, we have to run! You don't stand a chance right now! Don't be stupid! He's already made a fool of me once! I can't just run off with my tail between my legs! That doesn't matter! Just go! Listen to your fairy partner for once, would you? Hey! Stop pulling on me! So, the boy is a poor fencer, but something about him caused my soul to tremble. I don't think they're cheap. You can let go of my hand now. I can't believe you managed to run off like that. I totally could have taken it. What's this? He was a veteran fencer. You don't even know how to boost your fairy. There's no way you were winning that fight. Yeah, well, whatever. Listen, I can tell you're upset that you lost. You don't want to fight like he does. Then accept me as your partner and let's go find the rest of the furies. Then we can revive the goddess. What are you talking about? Don't tell me what to do next. Like I already said, I'm not interested in doing anything that sounds like a hassle. What does that mean? Did you forget how I saved you earlier? Don't you have a conscience? Conscience? Never heard of it. Later. Wait! I... I don't have any memory. Huh? Your memories are gone? Yeah. I know that I have to revive the goddess, but I don't remember how I'm supposed to do that. So... So... What? pissed me off that I wasn't able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with him. I don't really give a crap about your goddess, but I suppose I could use your help until I paid that bastard back. So 
you're saying... I'm saying I'll become your partner. See? You really are a nice guy after all. But I do have one condition. Condition? <laughs> I guess some of those guards are still alive. Friggin' persistent. Fried rice? Idiot. It's pronounced fair eyes. There's no ice in it. What does this fair ride thing even do? Stop talking and just shout it out. Fair eyes! Just shout it out. Okay. Fair rice! <sighs> Nothing happened. I look like an idiot just now. You are an idiot. Like I said, it's not fair rice, it's fair rice. Do it again, and this time make sure you pronounce the Z! Let's do this! Stop resisting! Get ready! Stomach earlier? Why did I pose like that? This is so damn embarrassing. With this, your combat strength has increased drastically. Come on, let's go! So, Fair Rise basically transforms me, right? Then wouldn't it be cooler if I shouted, It's Henshin time! Jeez, you're so nitpicky. I said, let's go! See what I Seriously, I need a better explanation. Come on, let's go! Get ready! Stay down! Impossible! would be a hassle, but if it lets me bust out awesome power like that, then I guess it's not so bad. So, what was that condition you mentioned earlier? I'm the one who decides my fate. Even if I have to will that fate into existence, make sure you never forget that. Wow, that sounded really cool for some reason! What, what exactly do you mean by that? Basically, I'm gonna eat when I wanna eat and sleep when I wanna sleep. Why, you simple-minded... <sighs> Fine.
long way, so the coast should be clear now. Anyway, how can you get your memories back? If we just collect the Furies, I'm sure we'll eventually meet a Fury who knows who I am. What if we don't meet one? As long as you collect all 100 Furies, the Goddess will be revived. Once that happens, I'm sure I'll remember everything. All 100 of them? Uh, that sounds like it'll take forever. Just who the heck is this goddess, anyway? She's the deity who oversaw the peace of this world a long time ago. But she's in a deep sleep right now. Well, I don't want to wake her up if she's sleeping. I'll feel bad. I just want to hurry up and get your memories back so I can end this adventure already and return to my normal life. Oh, whatever. Let's just collect the furies for now. Hey there, handsome. Well, well, well. You just made my day. It's true. I'm very handsome. Anyway, who the heck are you? I'm Lola. I work as a Jill of all trades. You're a fencer, aren't you? That means you're looking for furies, and I happen to peddle useful information about them. This seems a little sketchy. Do you really have useful information? Of course, but you better pay me what it's worth. I hate hagglers. Nice. You get down to business fast. I guess I'll buy what you're selling. Wonderful. Thank you for your patronage. As requested, here's some information about a fury. But before I divulge that info, you gotta pay me first. I'm running a special promotion today, so I'll sell it to you for this price. That's outrageous! No point in arguing. If that's her price, give me the money so I can pay her. Whoa, you're loaded! Where did you get all this money anyway? Don't tell me you stole it. While you were locked up in that cell, I sold off all my accessories. I figured it'd come in handy eventually. Huh. That's surprisingly thoughtful of you. So then, I guess we'll just go ahead and use it now. Wonderful! Thank you for your patronage. My sources tell me that a fury can be found at the Soul Plains. They say the monsters there are pretty tough. Good luck with that. Take care now. Bye-bye then. The Soul Plains, huh? That's really far. You should just go by yourself. What are you saying? We're in this together, remember? Come on. Don't just stand there picking your nose. Let's get going already. I know that. Don't boss me around. I wasn't picking my nose. <laughs> 